horizontal lines and scrolling text. Um, so adding horizontal lines breaks up the text. It's another nice way to break up the text. It says click the cursor after the H1 in your name and type a web page. So we want this to stay instead of your name, your name's web page. So instead of just Mr. Catherine, it's going to be Mr. Catherine's web page. So, um, so that you'll see that changes over there. Um, okay. And then we're going to add this marquee code. This, these marquee key tags are really cool. They add, make your text move. So um, I'm going to go over here and in front of this H1, we're going to type a bracket, M-A-R-Q-U-E-E, -E, bracket. And then the second slash one appears. I'm going to cut and paste that, so I'm going to cut that from there and paste it over here. Now when we click Run, you'll see that your name is scrolling. It's scrolling across the page. So, and then there are some other marquee codes if you want to have it slide in and stop or do other cool stuff. You can look at other cool marquee codes. Okay, so it says marquee, your names, web page, marquee. We just did all that. So it says type your name again above your address and at a line break, a BR after it. So above my here, I'm going to press enter, move the, parent, the address down one, and I'm going to type my name again. Right there. So it has the scrolling text. My name. Oh, there's a BR after your my name. So I gotta put that BR in there. BR bracket. <clears throat> and click the cursor after the second marquee and type a HR. So okay, so after the, the second marquee, we're going to add two horizontal rules. The HR stands for horizontal rule. They're horizontal lines. So right after marquee, I'm going to press enter. And bracket HR. And then go down one, bracket HR. Bracket. And then when I click run, you'll see two lines appear over here. So now that's a nice way to split your title up from the web rest of your web page is to have a horizontal line go across there. So then your name, then the address, then the email address, then code. Okay. So your name should or your page should now look like this. Scrolling text, two lines, your name and address. Um, some information that you added about yourself, and then a line for your email address. And that is the end of step five.